President, please be seated. Le président. Veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now in session. L'audience est ouverte. Mrs. Sakovati, the greffier, could you report Madame the attendance of the parties and individuals to the proceeding today? Sir Kovati, Mr. President, all parties to the Monsieur proceeding are present except the accused Yengsari, who is absent due to his health issues. However, the accused Where he is right to hear the testimony of TCW 91, the letter of waiver has been submitted to the Gratier. After Wakan, the international lawyer for Kills and Porn is absent due to personal affairs. And Mrs. Francois Gautry, the civil party lawyer who has already been recognized by the Association of Cambodia has yet to be recognized by the trial chamber. As for the witness TCW 91 who is to testify today is waiting in the room to be called by the chamber. The witness Confirms to his best knowledge he has no relation by blood or by law to any of the three accused or any of the civil parties who have been recognized in this case. The witness already took an oath this morning. The duty counsel is saying Reti. Maître Saint Reti est l'avocat. De service pour la President, pour le témoin. thank you. Le président. In today's proceeding, the chamber noticed one of the civil party lawyers who has not yet recognized by the chamber. And the instance. chamber, in pursuant to the applicable internal rule, will initiate the process of recognition of the civil party lawyer. La reconnaissance de ce Pursuant to Rule 22-2A of the internal rules, conformément donc à la règle 22 the Chamber would like to invite Mr. Peck Ong, the civil party lead co-lawyer, to stand up and request for the recognition of this international civil party lawyer. Du Conseil des Parties as he has not yet been recognized by the trial effet, chamber. Le conseil n'a pas encore été retenu, reconnu par la chambre. Pekong. Pekong. Good morning, Mr. President, Your Honours, and Président, parties to the proceeding Madame, and everyone. Le juge, toutes les parties, la behind me et tous is ceux vous Mrs. Vous Francois Gautry. Maître Françoise Gautry. She is French. De nationalité française. And she is from the Advocate Without a Border. She is from the Bar Association of Courage from France. And in Cambodia, she has been recognized by the Bar Association of Cambodia. She also took an oath before the Court of Appeal of Cambodia in 2009. 
for that reason, I request the recognition by the trial chamber so Et that she can defend the interests of the civil parties before this chamber. I'm grateful to your President, thank you. Mrs. François Gaudry, please stand. Ms. François Gaudry, you are hereby recognized by the trial chamber as a lawyer for civil parties for the purpose of the proceedings before this chamber. And based on that recognition, you enjoy the same rights and privileges as those of the civil party lawyers. Please be seated. inform the parties and the general public that during the last few days the trial chamber postponed the proceedings in hearing the testimony for a total of five days, that is uh, two weeks, two days from last week, and three days within this week. The reason is that the accused injury has a health issue that he has to be treated in the hospital at the emergency unit at the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital since last Friday. So far, he's still being treated at that hospital. And the chamber also schedules to hear the witness TCW 307 last week who was summoned by the trial chamber as a reserve witness since the first week of September and the subsequent weeks. However, due to the clear position by the accused injury not to waive his right to hear the testimony of that witness TCW 307, the chamber could not hear the testimony as a result. And today the trial chamber will hear the testimony of the witness TCW 91. Although Yingsari is still being treated at the hospital, Yingsari is toujours à l'hôpital. As the chamber is seized of the letter of waiver of his presence in the hearing of that witness TCW 91, le document by Yingsari dated 18 September 2012 through his counsel, the document is. E E eleven slash eighty seven point one. Sa défense donc que le document porte la cote E onze bar. The chamber would like to add that besides the witness T C W ninety one, who is waived by Mr Ian Sari to hear his testimony, Ian Sari also requests to be his direct presence to some other witnesses and civil party, namely TCW-475, and for that reason that witness may be heard voilà donc next week, starting from Tuesday, the 25th September, de mardi, 25 September without the presence of Ian Sari if he is unable to do so. So this is for your information. And before I invite the witness TCW91 to the courtroom, the chamber would like to inquire with the counsel for Yung Sari regarding the waiver of the right of your client to hear the witness TCW91 si la défense a des précisions à porter sur le sujet de ce témoin de TCW91 on 18 septembre 2012 tenant compte du document that is Tuesday uh, signé le 18 septembre 2012 is there any change to that uh, condition or status y a-t-il changement à la position adoptée um, par l'accusé good morning Mr. President your honors Bonjour, le Président. the co-prosecutors colleagues and everyone in and around the courtroom Ici aux Mr. Ying Sari, 
attended the hearing in order to expedite the proceeding before this chamber. And although he is being treated at the Khmer Soviet Hospital, and as the president indicated, he waves his direct presence or his remote presence to hear some witnesses, including TCW91. However, for these witnesses, in a circumstance where the testimony is different from what is already in the case file, or where the testimony incriminates my client, then we wish that his waiver is not and void and await his direct presence to hear that witness. Et l'accusé demande donc thank à you. pouvoir entendre directement le témoin. Je vous remercie. President, thank you. Le président, je vous remercie. Court officer, could you invite the witness TCW91 into the courtroom? Dans le prétoire, le témoin TCW91. Defense counsel, you may proceed. La parole est à la défense. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. President. Uh, um, I would first of all like to say that I'm very happy to be back, happy to be back in the courtroom since the recess for the summer. Um, I had one uh, small request for clarification, and maybe I can do that, uh, make that request while we're waiting for the witness to arrive. Um, uh, during my absence, I uh, checked the uh, website of the court uh, on a regular basis, and I did so last week as well, and I noticed that the uh, biography of uh, the president of this court, Neil Non, uh, has been uh, redacted recently. The, the reference to uh, the president, uh, president's biography, uh, the many publications in the field of criminal law has been taken out of the biography. It's not there anymore. It used to be there until recently. This is uh, uh, surprising, as I uh, have asked uh, for this list of publications on various occasions in the past. I asked for this list on the 24th of April, on the 13th of June, and also on the 18th of June in court, and also in writing uh, to the senior legal officer of this court. And I've never received an answer. Uh, I'm uh, still curious, more than ever, to know why Enfin, ma curiosité est piquée, uh, j'aimerais savoir the biography pourquoi the president of this court was redacted la and why we were we never informed about the reasons why the reference to the many publications in the field of international or criminal law has been deleted. Does this mean, we would like to know, does this mean President Neil Non has not published many publications in the field of criminal law, which I am beginning to suspect, and if this is the case, si tel est le cas, all this suggests a creative approach uh, to facts unbefitting a judge un fait or a trial chamber, which is supposed to independently and vigorously pursue the truth. So we would like to have a clarification as to why the biography of the president of this chamber has been changed and why the reference to the many publications in the field of criminal law has been deleted without informing us about the reasons why. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Defence Counsel, for your notice regarding my personal biography. And 
I'd like to state that this is a separate issue. Il s'agit d'un and it's a minor issue related to my biography. Let me say that I am not the one who made many publications. I made some publications for the purpose of internal use of the some of the national courts and at the school for judges. And they are summary reports. Ce sont des rapports, des résumés. However, regarding the consultation uh, with some lawyers, they suggested that Après those articles or publications shall be included in my biography. Que those articles mainly deal with the criminal aspect of the law. Euh, on the sentencing, sentencing pénal, issues, for instance, le, so that the articles can be used at the school of a church. And ces many of those juges. students are interested in those articles while I was teaching at that Était intéressé plutôt par ces articles and I wrote many articles regarding the rules for the administration the of the domestic court. Pour des it does nationaux. not mean I am the sole author. Ça ne veut pas dire it means que that I have experience in that area que de dans le at the level of the at the national level. Au niveau and national. as I observe that here the standard of writing is much higher comme vu ici, in particular in reference to the footnotes which is uh, an international page, standard uh, is much higher than my writing or article. And based on that, I consulted with the legal officers that, that there could be controversy coming out juristes, of the inclusion of that si person in my biography uh, because such a writing or article shall not be included in the biography as in compared to some other biographies before the ECCC. Car cela and ne peut être, that sans is doute pas comparable and if you would like to find all those articles or publications, si vous you can go to the school for a judges and I Left copies there while I was exemplaires. teaching there and sharing experience there regarding the rules for sentencing, according to the Cambodian law during the transitional period. Pendant la période de, de transition. As well as the regulations regarding the, administra the judicial administration Tout during the transitional period, period uh, période de transition. before the enactment of the Code of Criminal Procedure or the Code of the Civil Procedure. Du du Cambodge, et le code de procédure civile. And let me say that you can't find those articles. I am not the one who writes books and sells books as a profession, but those articles are available. De façon de façon professionnelle, mais ces articles sont tout à fait disponibles. Court officer, could you invite the witness into the courtroom? My response is more than sufficient for you regarding the matter you raised. And if you are not satisfied, you can do so further according to the applicable rule and procedure before this ECCCC. Some look Michael and Mr. Michael Pressman, Pressman, if you still have issues regarding this matter, you can make it in writing si vous avez to respond to choses à dire sur le sujet, vous pouvez le faire my écrit. statement just then, because Donc, so far there has been some réponse. controversies regarding oral and written submissions versus oral and written, written ruling. 
des our response confusion and we already set the schedule that this morning alors elle a écrit et des the court will be given to one side of the court and for the afternoon session it will be allocated to the other side of the court and I will not allow the time to be debated on other issues that will be and I will not allow the time to be debated on other issues that will be and I will not allow the time to be debated on other issues that will be and I will not allow the time to be debated on other issues that will be and I will not allow the time to be debated on other issues that will be and I will not allow the President, good morning, Mr. Tiesai. Is Tiesai your correct name? Tiesai. Is that your name? Response. Response. Good morning, Mr. President. My name is Tiesai. Je m'appelle Tiesai. Question. Besides Tiesai, do you have any other names or alias? Tiesai. Avez-vous d'autres noms ou surnoms? Please wait, Mr. Kisai, until you see the red light on your microphone. You will see the red light on the head of the microphone and on the console, and then you can start to speak. As three languages are used in this court. Mr. Kisai, how old are you? Mr. Kisai, what age are you? Response. Réponse. I am 59 years old. J'ai 59 ans. Question. Where is your current address? Où habitez-vous? Response. Réponse. My address is. Je suis. At Klong Village. Au village de Klong. Ottawa. Commune Pailin District, Pailin City. District de Pailin, ville de Pailin. Question: What is your current occupation? Quelle est votre profession? Response: Réponse: I am a farmer. Je travaille comme agriculteur. Question: What is Question. your father's name? Quel est le nom de votre père? Response: His name is Kao Chie. Il s'appelle Kao Chie. Question and your mother's name. Question. Comment s'appelle votre mère? Response. Her name is Chie Peng. Elle s'appelle Chie Peng. Question. What is your wife's name? Comment s'appelle votre épouse? Response. Réponse. Her name is Sao Sarun. Sao Sarun. Question: How many children do you have? Et combien d'enfants avez-vous? Response: Réponse. I have four children, two boys and two girls. Deux garçons et deux filles. Question: What is your level of education? Quel est votre niveau d'instruction? Response. I studied literature at the school in a pagoda in year 12 in the old education system, and I ordained for one year. Question: Rather, year 10 in the old system. Question: Can you read and write? Question: Savez-vous lire et écrire? Response: I can read and write. That is the Khmer characters. Thank you, Mr. Tiesai. As reported by the graffier, to your best knowledge, you have no relation by blood or by law to any of the accused or the civil parties in this case. Lequel qu'on les ou des parties civiles constituées dans ce dossier? The three accused are Nunchir, Yingsari, and Kiesampon. Is that information correct? That's exact. Response. I have no relation to any of the three accused. 
Also, as reported by the Greffier, you already threw an oath before you entered the this courtroom. Is that correct? That's exact. Response. Response. Yes, oui. I threw an oath before serment. I came into this courtroom. Avant de venir. President. We would like to inform you of your right and obligation for the proceeding before this chamber as a witness, Mr. Chiesai, for the proceeding before this chamber, you may refuse to respond to any questions which may incriminate yourself. That is the right against self-incrimination. It means if you believe your response may put you si vous in a position to be prosecuted and as a witness before this rencontre. chamber, you must respond to questions put to you by the bench or by vous any other parties, except in the case vous de where your response to the questions or your questions comments vous les juges et les could incriminate yourself. And as a witness, you must tell the truth that you have heard, have experienced, or have remembered entendu, vu, of what you came across or observed directly in regards to an event in the question put to you by the chip bench or by any other parties. Do you understand that? Événements. Lorsque euh, les, yes, les juges ou les parties vous posent des questions. Comprenez-vous Réponse Oui, je comprends. Thank you. Le président. Merci. Mr. Chiesai, were you ever interviewed by the Monsieur investigators Chiesai. of the Office of the Co-Investigating Judges Avez-vous été so, entendu par les enquêteurs travaillant pour le compte du bureau des causes d'instruction Ou et that. quand et combien de fois, si vous vous en souvenez Response. Réponse. It was conducted at my house, but I cannot recall the, the rest. Je ne me souviens pas des autres détails. But surely I was interviewed. Mais oui, j'ai été entendu par les How many times were you interviewed Question. Combien de fois Response. Réponse. They came to interview me for one time. Ils sont venus. But une fois. they came to meet me for two or three times, but they were different people. Ils sont venus me voir deux ou trois fois, mais c'était des gens différents. Question. Before you enter the courtroom. Question. Have you seen or read that record of interview that you gave to the Avant investigators of the Office of the Co-Investigating Judges in order to de vos refresh your memory? Afin de rafraîchir votre mémoire. Response. Mr. Réponse. President, let me apologize. I tend to forget uh, quite a lot. My memory is not uh, that uh, great. Mes mémoires pas très bonne. The President, have you read the, President. the records of your interviews? Response. Réponse. Yes, I have. Oui. But uh, my memory doesn't serve me very well, Mais and I have ma to pas très bonne. admit this. Et the president, according to your best recollection, ici, can you tell the chamber, after selon, reading selon your record of interview, whether the records are consistent with the accounts si you gave before the investigators or not? Because you say that you uh, have gave these interviews at your home before. Response. Réponse. 
Yes, indeed, Mr. President. Uh, oui, the accounts effet, are consistent Président. to what I gave before the co-investigators co The President, uh, thank you. À mon domicile. Le Président, je vous remercie. For the co-prosecution, uh, during the cross-examination, the Chamber will allocate la chambre accordera the time for the prosecution to put questions uh, to the witness before the other parties to the proceeding. And please be informed that uh, both the prosecution mm. and lead co lawyers for the civil party will be allocated uh, the whole morning to put questions to the witness. For the afternoon session, uh, time will be solely allocated to the three defense councils to pose the questions to the witness. Mr. Co-prosecutors and legal lawyers would also be asked to advise the Chamber qui, uh, on how the time vous is divided uh, among themselves uh, so that the Chamber is uh, uh, le temps de parole well informed. Vous, uh, you may not proceed. Adéquatement informé de la manière dont vous comptez procéder. Mr. President, Your Honours, uh, good morning. The time will be allocated such that the lead co-lawyers anticipate uh, for the civil parties anticipate that their questioning will only occupy about 10 or 15 minutes of this morning. I hope that helps. Des parties civiles de poser leurs questions. Il semble qu'ils n'auront besoin que d'une dizaine ou d'une quinzaine de minutes pour ce faire. The President, uh, yes, it does. Uh, Le Président, you, um, oui. Uh, we would like to hear also from the civil parties. Oui, nous aimerions que les parties civiles s'expriment également. Mr. Pekang, Mr. Pec President and Your Honours, uh, Mrs. Binier will be juges, allocated uh, the time to put questions and she may need about la qui les 20 questions. to 30 minutes Elle for that, de, uh, de the President. Thank you. Now, co-prosecutor, you may now proceed. Vous avez la parole. Mr. Wayne Hort. Good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, Your Honours. Mr. Wayne Hort, bonjour, Monsieur le Président. And, and good morning, Mr. Chiesai. Bonjour, Monsieur Chiesai. I am from the Office of Co-Prosecutors. Uh, je suis membre du Bureau des Co-Procureurs. Before putting the questions, uh, Avant may de vous I poser des wish questions, to remind uh, uh, you vous rappeler. On a few points, you just stated before the chamber uh, that uh, your memory is not very uh, uh, good uh, for the time being. But I wish to read the document under ER 1020 through 85 in Khmer, ER in English, 0076-63. 37 through 38 French EIN numbers 00524341 uh, uh, my apologies uh, in French 00524341 through 42 in that document uh, you indicated that vous indiquez que in the previous interviews, you Lors said that you worked at K12, which was part of Office 870, and you worked at the auto repair unit from 1975 all the way to the time when the Vietnamese came in 1979, and you were tasked with repairing cars and also drove les trucks les véhicules, to transport medics and soldiers. Camions, and you said that the head of K-12 was Tamil. May I ask uh, whether you know the full name of Tamil? Is he Sang Krun? Qui est ce Tamil? Vous en souvenez-vous? S'agit-il de Sang Krun? Response. Réponse. I wish to respond to your question. Oui, en réponse à votre question. I worked with him. J'ai travaillé avec lui. And I only lui. know he was Tamil. 
I don't know his full name. He was supervising a unit, uh, auto repair unit, and that's the only name I know of him. Question. You say it. Tamil was vous, removed vous or Tamil disappeared in 1978. Do you know what happened to him after his disappearance? Response. Réponse. Although I used to live with him, I did not know what he did uh, wrong, I just learned that he disappeared, and that's all. Who was the deputy head uh, or chairperson of K-12? Response. Yes. I know that person by the name of Boy. Cette personne, je la connaissais sous le nom de Boy. I I remember his name, although not very clearly, because it was more than forty years ago when I worked with him. Plus de quarante ans. Question. You said that K-12 was part of Office 870 under supervision of Pang. Or Pang, rather. What happened to Pang? Did you know about this? Savez-vous quelque chose à ce sujet? Response. Pang was known to me because he... Je le connaissais parce que worked uh, at K-12 and also uh, Office 870, but he then disappeared. Question. I may wish to also seek a clarification from you whether Pong had disappeared before Mill disappeared. Response. Mr. President, uh, I don't remember concerning disappearance. I know for je, sure je that these people si disappeared, but I don't know who disappeared disparu, first and who qui a disappeared later. Qui a disparu plus tard. It was more than 40 years ago. Ça fait plus de ans. Question, who Question. was Pang's successor at Office qui 870? Response. Réponse. At that time, à cette I époque, am not sure, but there was a person by the name of certain, Lin mais il y who avait une personne uh, belonged to a tribe, Lin, qui à or une ethnic minority. minority ethnic. Question. Can you tell the court Question. if you remember where K-12 was located? Cour, si vous vous en où se Response. K if you come all the, the way from Chamkamon, then Jamkamon, you would pass a hospital, vous passez devant uh, or hospital Chinese hospital, Chinois. and that location would be on the left-hand side, just across from the gas station. And K-12 also had uh, its uh, branch office, uh, which is uh, an office for auto repair. Question, how many people were employed at that K-12? Response. So far as I remember, there were two groups of people in two sections. I was tasked with repairing the trucks and driving or transporting people, and there were about 30 people in my unit. Question. I would like to go back a little bit uh, by putting a few more questions. As a cadre at K-12, what information did 
lesquelles they give you les after the disappearance of Pang. Qui vous ont été, quelles, quelles sont les informations qui vous ont été fournies après la disparition de Pang? Réponse. Frankly speaking, I was not a cadre. Uh, dire vrai, je uh, pas cadre. My position at that time was nothing but a worker. I was a person who was tasked with repairing the car. If I were the cadre, I could have been executed or disappeared already. Question. Question. When Mill disappeared and when Pang disappeared, what What kind of information were you told about them and who could have been the person who told you about this? Sujet et qui aurait été la personne vous donnant ces informations? Response. Réponse. I, at that time, no one could come to tell à, us à about the disappearance of anyone. We could just learn from one another informally. Because we didn't see de them informelle par contact les uns avec les autres, tout, tout simplement parce qu'on ne voyait plus euh, ces personnes. Question. Question. Can you also tell the court, please, whether K-12 had cours, already been established si when you arrived or déjà you vous were part arrivé, of the founder ou bien si of vous K-12? Avez fait partie de ceux qui ont fondé K-12? Response. Réponse. K-12 office had already been established bureau, when le, I came to work K-12 there. K-12 existait déjà lorsque, lorsque j'y suis arrivé pour travailler. Question. Question. With regard to other cadres who worked at K-12, where did they come from? Response. The majority of them came from the north zone and the east zone. Des zones nord et est. Question. Question. I would like to proceed to a more... J'aimerais to spécifique maintenant. Was a K-12 uh, for serving or providing service to K-12 Office 870 alone? Fournissait des services exclusivement au bureau 870? Response. Réponse. K-12 was K-12 a part of auto repair unit for office 870 I can say because I used to see Pang coming to that uh, unit uh, talking or working with Tamil question early on you said that there were people employed at that unit do you know these people very well Connaissiez-vous bien ces personnes? Response. Réponse. I'm afraid I don't. Uh, at that time, they were bien peur que non. younger than I was. Uh, Ils étaient à l'époque the, they were plus jeunes young people. Que moi. C'était and des, people des went gens. to different places and I don't et remember them very well. And I remember bon only two people, Mill and Boy, who et one was the head uh, and one was the deputy. Était le responsable et l'autre était Question. Son adjoint. You Question. said that uh, 30 vous, people vous worked in your unit. personnes travaillaient dans votre unité. My question is, Ma question est la suivante. did all the 30 people Est-ce in the unit remain intact or l'unité some of them disappeared euh, before 1979? Response. The majority of la the workers at the repair, auto repair unit were moved. de réparation automobile euh, ont été euh, retirés. Question. 
Do you know where the could question have been removed uh, to? Savez-vous où on aurait peut-être pu les emmener? Response. Réponse. No, I don't. Uh, no. But I heard that, uh, heard from others that some of Mais them were removed to the train repair unit uh, and some would be sent uh, to the production de unit. Ferroviaire, uh, et de transport. Question. Among the 30 people parmi les 30 or workers, personnes, did you join the group, for example, during meal times and other discussions? Est-ce que vous déjeuniez avec eux, par exemple? Est-ce qu'il y avait des discussions ou des réunions qui se déroulaient avec eux? Response. Réponse. During that time, Au cours de cette période, there was no a big problem in my unit after work. Uh, we could uh, come and sit down and on pouvait chit -chat. aller et bavarder. Question. Question. You were talking about chit chatting. Were you chit chatting de, de about the progress vous, of work vous or about sur other topics? Les progrès accomplis dans, dans votre travail Response. ou d'autres sujets? Réponse. It depends. Ben, ça dépendait. Sometimes parfois we discussed about the progress of work, how we could uh, repair the cars more quickly. Sometimes we discussed uh, about food and other things. Questions alimentaires et autres sujets. Question. Question. I would like to ask you more specific questions concerning the 30 people who worked at the auto repair unit. Uh, how many of whom were drivers and how many of whom were workers to repair the cars? Response. For these 30 people, I only refer to the auto repair section, but for the K-12, there could have been more people than that. Mais pour le but at the, the auto repair section, I mean tracks the repair section, la, uh, there were only 30 people. De réparation des camions, il n'y avait que 30 personnes. Question. Question. You talk about Vous nous trucks and parler cars. de camions et de voitures. Who were in charge of transporting Qui avait la cadres to meetings? What kind of vehicle would be used Quel type de to carry these people back and forth? Response. Réponse. Cadres of a lower level would uh, be transported uh, by a normal vehicle. Transporté dans un véhicule normal. Uh, if the number of, uh, if there were a lot of people, then they si would uh, take de monde, a bus. And people did not uh, care what kind of Les transportation used uh, to accommodate de them. Transport utilisé pour, uh, Question. Les, euh, quelque part. You said Question. that uh, cadres didn't care about whether les they would be transported in a se small or big vehicle. Si but what kind of meetings were they uh, transported to? Vers quel type de réunion est-ce que euh, ces véhicules les transportaient-ils? Response. 
et réponse I as a subordinate uh, would not be able to understand the content of the meeting or what could have been discussed in the meeting of the countries discuter dans les Question. réunions de cadre. You say that you would not be able to know what happened in the meetings or about the meetings, but did you ever transport any of them Mais to any meeting? Est-ce que vous avez jamais transporté euh, l'un quelconque de ceux-ci vers l'une ou l'autre réunion? Réponse. Apart from repairing the car uh, mis à part la vehicles, des I vehicles. would uh, be asked uh, on some rare occasions to transport some de workers, le not cadres. I was uh, uh, sometimes asked to transport garbage to be dumped de uh, at the dump sites. Uh, des déchets, uh, dont il se Question. Uh, à la décharge. Do you know who Question. would be in the guard units uh, for Savez the senior leaders? Savez-vous qui faisait partie de l'unité chargée de la garde de la sécurité des dirigeants supérieurs? Réponse. D these uh, guards, uh, um, gardiens, now we could refer them as the bodyguards. On pourrait I think um, les gardes I do not corps. really remember knowing anyone Je of them because uh, I was so much attached uh, to the auto repair eux, unit uh, and I focused more on my work rather than wishing to know more about the others. Question, were you ever be promoted Question. or were you ever promoted? Response. promotion Response. At that time, I was nowhere uh, closer to the rank of a cadre. Uh, cette époque, je I was uh, merely a member, a person to be used by others. So I did not hold any position as a cadre of the regime. Question. I would like to ask Question. you a few more questions concerning Office 870. In your interviews, you say that 870 was in charge of supervising all the K officers and that uh, this officer was uh, supervised by the senior leaders, document 0020-4084 in Khmer, English ERN 0076 French ERN 0052-4342. With regard to this document, I would like to ask you who else uh, were in charge uh, of Office 870 apart from Pol Pot? Response. Office 870 was... Uh, supervised by some people, but I don't know them other than Paul Pot. The thing I am sure is that since uh, Paul Pot certain, was uh, the top leader, he could have been the one Pot who Pot was also in uh, charge of 870, but I never obtained any precise information to support this argument. The President Counsel for Mr. Yingsari, you may now proceed. Mr. Ang Dam. Thank you, Mr. President. I am not sure how well, this witness is informed on Certain responding to questions because uh, uh, he used uh, or uh, he, in his question, testimony, used uh, the terms as not sure, not clear. Not clear. Je pas sûr, je pas clair. May the witness be advised uh, to uh, be more precise when giving testimony uh, because by doing so it can save some objections from defense counsel. Uh, the president, thank you, counsel.
mettre the table will rule on this um, la chambre statuera sur finally. ce point if uh, witness gives uh, Donc, testimonies that um, are not clear si then the chamber will also clair. decide on the quality of la such testimonies but now before us it is up to counsel nous, or party who is on his feet to questions to the witness to ensure that the testimonies are straightforward and clear and the uh, only party who is putting questions to the witness would be in the best position to get the best answers and uh, for the chamber it is difficult for the president uh, to really tell witness to be more precise than that uh, because it doesn't even um, or it is not written in the criminal court of procedure Ceci about this nulle part dans, dans les de procedure. thank you Mr. President le Je remercie, le Mr. Président. Witness you said that Pang was in charge of 870 did you see Pang very often souvent. response réponse Mr. Pang, Monsieur Pang sometimes came to the place to see uh, leaders and I would see him, but he did not go there very often. He came there only occasionally. Souvent, de manière épisodique. Question. On what occasion did you Question. saw Pang? Uh, it means that while you were driving or under what circumstances you saw him. Ou dans quelles circonstances avez-vous uh, souvenir de l'avoir vu? Response. Réponse. I did not meet him je at office 870 and I went to office 870. I heard about it while I was at K12. J'en ai entendu parler lorsque j'étais à K12. came to inspect the work occasionally and that was the time that I saw him. I never went and see him at office 870. Mais je ne me suis jamais rendu au bureau 870 pour le rencontrer. Question. Question. If the vehicle of the leaders si broke down, where would they be? The vehicles des dirigeants venaient à tomber en panne. Où où étaient-ils réparés? Witness, please Le wait. Président, Defense Veuillez counsel, attendre, you may moi, Conseil pour la défense, je vous en prie. Counsel, thank you, Mr. President. The question la défense, by merci, the le Président. La question posée par l'accusation no est sans rapport avec la manifestation fear. de la vérité. Et on ne peut pas obtenir ce genre euh, de, de verser ce genre de réponse au Witness, dossier you do not en tant qu'élément de preuve. Le Président, Monsieur le Président, vous n'avez pas à Speculative kind of question. aux questions qui vous euh, poussent à spéculer. Thank you, Mr. President. I move on. Le président. Euh, le premier. Je vous remercie, M. le Président. Je vais question. passer à une autre série de questions. Who authorized the use of vehicles to transport important visitors or guests uh, to and from the airport? Le transport d'invités de marque par véhicule depuis l'aéroport ou vers l'aéroport. Response. Could you please repeat Réponse. your question as Vous it's not clear to me? Ce pas très clair dans mon esprit. President, 
That is a correct uh, procedure, Mr. Witness. If you are unclear, then you ask the questioner to repeat the question. Uh, as if you think the question is unclear, then you do not need to just uh, plainly respond. You need to understand the question first before you respond. Otherwise, you may ask the questioner to repeat the question. As for the national prosecutor, please refresh your question so that it can be understood by the witness. And the witness already informed us of the limited level of education Le témoin nous a déjà rappelé qu'il était peu instruit regime and that he ordained for one year et qu'il avait été moine pendant un an and if he studied during the times that he worked it would be in a different circumstance so please try to simplify your question so that the oui, witness can understand it and le témoin les comprend respond appropriately et puisse donner les réponses les réponses appropriées Thank you, Mr. President. Let me repeat my question, Mr. Witness. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Laissez-moi répéter ma question. When foreigners or representatives of a foreign country came to visit Cambodia or leaving Cambodia through the airport, par avion, which K office? that had the authority Quel for the authorization of using vehicle to transport those visitors back and from the airport. Response. As for the foreign visitors coming in and going out of Cambodia, Les K-12 had the Cambodge, duty to transport them. Qui However, they would fall under the car unit. I was at the truck unit, so I did not have this knowledge. Des voitures, plutôt. Moi, euh, à des camions. Please turn on the microphone. Look, 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 look. President, uh, the prosecutor, could you switch on your microphone le when you speak? Le procureur, veuillez attendre que... Veuillez mettre votre micro avant de prendre la parole. Prosecutor, thank you, Mr. Le President. Procureur. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Witness, I'd like to ask you another question. Which Kai office Monsieur provided témoin, the transport savoir. to carry... People Quel from K1 to K3? Des gens de K1 à K3. Response. I cannot recall that. Réponse. As je ne souviens I pas. said repeatedly, Comme je vous déjà répété, my memory does not serve me well. Je I pas très bonne have mémoire. been sick a lot été since 1979. Je suis and secondly, I cannot fait, recall it well. So I declined to très bien. respond Et to this question. Mm -hmm. question. 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 Can you recall which K office had the responsibility to transport the leaders to the meeting venues or to where they make their presentations? Réunions ou vers là où ils faisaient des présentations. Response. I am unclear as to what to respond to this question. Je ne sais pas vraiment quoi répondre. I do not really understand the question well. Je ne comprends pas bien votre question en fait. Question. The question is that Le which procureur. office, je and as you said, you bureau. were at K-12, vous avez dit que vous travailliez au bureau K-12. there were cars and buses to transport guests and people, and the question is, during the transportation of 
leaders to the meeting venues or to where they would make their presentation, who would transport them? Qui assurait le transport de ces personnes? Response. As I stated repeatedly, I did not know much about the transportation of those leaders. Pas grand chose de, de My main duty was different, Mes and différentes. I could not know the details of a such transportation of the leaders to this or that location. Des déplacements des dirigeants à tel ou tel endroit. Thank you, witness. Le procureur. Merci, Monsieur le témoin. I have no more questions Je for you, but I'd like to give the floor to my international colleague to put a question to you. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Mr. Chiesai, can I please just pick up on the parts of K-12? Que parle un peu de you worked, you've said, in the auto repair unit, unité de réparation des and you've mentioned that there was another part of K-12. What did you call the other part? Comment s'appelait l'autre service? Bad. Réponse. Office K-12 had different sections designated with the initial K, K as well. Qui avait aussi but une K-12 was K. the auto repair, K-12, K-4 that's for food, and uh, K-6 was K the medical part. So each designated K section had Donc their respective uh, work and assignment. K avait ses propres tâches. Question. Let me put, please, the question in a different way. You were responsible for the repair of vehicles. Was there another part of K-12 where vehicles, in other words, cars and trucks, were located? As I stated uh, earlier, at K-12 office, au bureau K12, there were sections with uh, small cars for transporting of voiture, transporting gas, and they would have their own repair unit within that car section. As for the truck section, we would pour ce qui be camions, responsible for carrying garbage or des poubelles, utilities or materials, des des or food, et la nourriture aussi. Can you help me on this? Was K-12 responsible at all for the transport of supplies, food, tools, matters of that kind, out of Phnom Penh to the provinces? K-12 office had trucks transporting supplies to the provinces, which at the time they were known as zones. So materials were transported to cooperatives. I learned that through my work colleagues, and as I stated, I worked at the auto repair section, and I only transported around within the Phnom Penh vicinity, not at the zone. You said in your OCIJ statement Dans votre déclaration devant les de uh, that your job, obviously, you, you've mentioned this already, et vous, vous déjà rappelé, was to repair cars, que votre était de la but de also to drive Mais soldiers que vous étiez aussi and medics et que within Phnom Penh. Is that des correct? À Phnom Penh. Yes, exactly. Yes, that is correct, oui, exact. because at that time, 
my main duty à was repairing vehicles, but sometimes when they needed drivers, then I would be asked to drive. For example, sometimes I was asked to drive medics to watch a movie. Des fois, par exemple, je devais conduire des médecins pour qu'ils aillent regarder un film. So I was used occasionally as a driver. Et donc à l'occasion, j'étais chauffeur. Et en ce qui du transport des soldats, it was before the liberation of Phnom Penh. Avant la de Phnom Penh. At that time, I was still a driver trainer, toujours trainee. un chauffeur en formation. Do you know what Question. S seventy one refers to? Savez-vous à quoi fait référence le code S soixante et onze? Frankly speaking, you, you talk about S1. Vous avez dit S1. Mr. Hayham Kane, during the Monsieur investigation, Hayham during the time that he met me, I was asked by him regarding that uh, office. Mm. Personally, I never knew that office. Had you, ce sujet. I'm Moi, even not clear on bureau. the number of that office. Is, is quelque chose, or something? S21, je crois. I never heard of je that office during the time that I worked at the auto repair section. De manutention des véhicules. During the time that you worked Question. at the auto repair section, did you ever see Q Sampan? Avez-vous jamais vu Q Sampan? I Réponse. occasionally saw him because at that time his children Je vu à stayed at car à K-12 office. Étaient au bureau K-12. Although I saw him, but I did not have any contact vu, with him. He was a, a senior person. Il était, so I saw him come in and then he left. Une de haut rang. Donc je vu venir I did not approach him, je pas osé but lui I saw him there. Mais je vu, oui. You've mentioned his children. Question, what were they doing then que, at the K-12 office? Que faisaient ces enfants à K-12? At that time, Réponse. his children were young. À l'époque, ces enfants étaient jeunes. They were children. C'était des enfants. They were looked after there. Et on s'occupait d'eux là-bas. They were about two or three years old at the time. Ils étaient âgés de deux ou trois ans. What was Q Sampan doing at the K-12 office? Que Q au bureau K-12? President, witness, please wait. Je le témoin, veuillez attendre avant de répondre. Defense counsel, you may proceed. La parole est à la défense. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le I observe that the international prosecutor repeats the question again and again. And the witness already responded clearly to that question. Uh, I haven't repeated the question again, Mr. President. Monsieur le Président. I've asked what was Q Sampan doing at the office. Que Q au I haven't asked that question before. Je n'ai pas encore posé the cette objections question. are unfounded in my respectful submission. Can I please proceed? Objection qui est non fondée. J'aimerais pouvoir poursuivre mon interrogatoire. Bah. Le président. President, the objection is unfounded. L'objection est en effet non fondée. And the witness is instructed to respond to the le last question put to you by the que lui a posé le prosecutor. And witness, if you can recall the si last question, you can pas, ask the prosecutor to repeat that. Prosecutor, you may continue la your est à time. Please repeat your question. It is likely that question. the witness le can la recall it. What was Q Sampan doing que Q Sampan at the K-12 office? K K-12 office Réponse. was a branch 
he drove the car into the office, K12, but I did not observe what he was doing there pas, as I was working. My understanding is that his children were there, so he went to see là, his children. Pour venir les voir. But I did not know the details or what he was doing there at the time. Ce qu'il faisait à ce bureau à l'époque. I was engaging in my work and I would be blamed if I stop and just go and follow him and look at him. Je travailler pour le suivre et l'observer. My focus was on the completion of my assignment. Moi, ce qui m'intéressait, c'était de m'acquitter des tâches qui m'étaient confiées. Was K-12 responsible for driving the senior leaders around? Le bureau K-12 avait-il la responsabilité du transport des dirigeants dans la ville? I think that question has been asked. Je pense qu'on a déjà posé la question. My main task was. Auto repair. Moi, je m'occupais so de la réparation des automobiles. Et je ne sais rien du transport de dirigeants. Je m'occupais de réparer. Ce sont les chauffeurs qui pourraient vous parler du transport des dirigeants. Moi, j'étais euh, un membre de rang plutôt inférieur au sein de l'équipe. I want to move on, please, to the subject of political education. The ERNs that are relevant to this section are as follows. Uh, English 007 66336 Khmer 00204083 and French 00766343. Now you said, Mr. Chiasai, in your interview with the investigators, that you participated many times in political education at the Technological Institute and also at Borekela. How many times did you attend, roughly? Combien de fois avez-vous en moyenne participé? But that is correct. Réponse. Oui, c'est exact. At that time, à l'époque. It is common that leaders educated the subordinates, those uncles, taught us politics. And as raised by those who came to interview me, during the political training, the main theme would be on working hard, on economization, on Engaging in good work, faire du bon travail, être efficace. Je m'en souviens, je m'en souviens bien. C'était le thème principal des formations que j'ai reçues. On economization and on working hard to build the country. De travailler fort pour l'édification du pays. And we were called to the training on. Occasional basis on these themes. Et à l'occasion, donc, nous étions appelés à venir étudier ces sujets. So how many times roughly were you called? Donc, environ combien de fois avez-vous participé à des formations politiques? I cannot recall that. Je ne m'en souviens pas. It's been so so long ago. Ça fait très longtemps. It's almost 40 years, and of course my memory does not serve me well, and I also have a heart issues. But what I can say is that I did attend the study sessions, but I cannot recall how many times. Mais je ne me souviens pas de la fréquence à laquelle 
Vous avez dit dans votre interview que c'était Ta Mir qui a appointé vous à aller dans ces formations. Que c'est Ta Mir qui vous avait dit d'aller participer à ces formations. Et c'était toujours Ta Mir qui vous avait envoyé ou y avait-il d'autres gens? It is clear the person who supervised a section was the one who authorized the study, the staff to go for the study session. And when we knew the place, we just gathered around and went there without having to be laid there by the chairperson. It was usually at the technical institute or at the Each particular person was assigned to go. We would just gather ourselves and went there, as we knew the place already. Même quand on savait déjà où c'était. You mentioned that there were thirty people. Il y avait une trentaine de personnes. Working with you in the auto repair unit. Travaillait avec vous à l'unité de réparation des véhicules. Now, would each of those persons also go and attend these courses? Est-ce que chacune de ces personnes allait participer à la formation? Amongst the 30 staff, we took turn to attend the study session. Nous y sommes allés à tour de rôle. So, for example, I would go this time, and next time, somebody else would take place. Cette fois-ci, j'y allais, et l'autre fois, c'est quelqu'un d'autre qui allait à ma place. Now, thinking of the study sessions that you went on. Parlons maintenant des formations politiques auxquelles vous avez participé. How long was the longest? Study session that you attended. Quelle était la formation politique la plus longue que vous ayez suivie? Bah, donc nous. As I said earlier. Réponse. It's been so long already, so I cannot recall how many days the study session lasted. Très longtemps, je ne me souviens pas du nombre de jours qu'a duré la formation. I cannot recall the study session. Je ne peux que vous confirmer que j'ai participé à des formations. But I cannot recall the specific duration of the study session. Je ne me souviens pas de combien de temps ils ont duré. I'm so old now, and it's been since I was 20 years old. J'avais 20 ans à l'époque. Mr. Chairsai. Just can you confirm this from your testimony that some of the study sessions lasted days? In other words, more than one day. Is that correct? That's exact. The political study session. Lasted at least three days, never one day. Au moins trois jours. Ce n'était jamais une seule journée. But I could not say whether it lasted six days, seven days, or ten days. But at least it lasted three days. Au moins trois jours. As for other normal study session, it would be an hour or two. Formation, it did not last that long. But it's different from the political study session. Les cours étaient différents des séances de formation politique. I'd like you to concentrate, please, on the political question. study sessions. Ne pensiez Now, at the start of these sessions, Donc, au début would somebody give an introductory talk to the people present? Allocution, introduction, présentation euh, au début. At that time, those people who were referred to in the present time as MC or Master of Ceremony, although it might not be the appropriate term at the time, but yes, there were those who actually made the presentation on the opening of the study session, and usually it was the senior leaders who would do that. En général, c'était les hauts dirigeants qui s'occupaient de cela. So, in in we would say the program opener in Khmer. Donc en Khmer, on dirait celui qui ouvre le programme. 
as I said, it's been uh, so long already, it's almost 40 years, so I can't recall such a detail. Ans, je ne me souviens pas de tous les détails. Um, in your OCIJ interview, Question. Dans le you verbal, said that the teachers on the political courses vous indiquez que les enseignants, ceux qui font des interventions, étaient Nguyen Chien et Kyu Sang. I'd like you to concentrate first, please, on Nguyen Chien. At these study sessions, what did he talk about? Pensiez à Nguyen Chien. De quoi parlait-il lors de ses cours de formation politique? I think I answered twice already regarding the political study session. A des questions sur les formations politiques. Nunchi and Kirsten Paul taught us during the political study sessions, focusing on those themes that I said on the economization and on strengthening of working hard. They did not teach us on doing anything bad at all. As I can call it clearly, that we should strive to work hard in order to build the country. We should not be forced to edify and construct the country. And that is the real situation at that time, and that was the truth. As I can call it clearly. And that is the truth. And that is the truth. And since then, in my mind. In my communication or liaison with the people, I always focus on donc, the good point, a positive point, savez, and that has been gens, indoctrinated in my mind that I should only do good acts to other people choses, and not a bad autres, act, and to help them if needed. Maybe my response is rather long, but that is the truth. Besoin. Je sais que c'est une réponse un peu longue, mais c'est la vérité. Uh, Mr. Chesai, is your memory that Nguyen Chair and Q Sampong were covering the same sort of subjects or different subjects? We can say the two came from the same family. They spoke on the same subject matters. In short, they talk about the points that I just raised. Ils parlaient de ce because they are from the same team. Que je viens de vous dire, ils étaient au sein de la même équipe. From members of the same family. On pourrait dire qu'ils étaient les membres de la même famille. Même parti. Refer to the current situation. So the political education is the same. Il faisait référence donc à la situation et la formation politique qu'il donnait était la même. Try and help me on this if you can. Aidez-moi à comprendre. If there was a study session, or you said that study sessions lasted at least three days. Vous avez dit que les formations politiques duraient au moins trois jours. What portion of those three days Sur would be taken up with the addresses by Nguyen Chia and Q Sampan? Pendant combien de temps parlait Nguyen Chia et Q Sampan? Response. Uh, could you please repeat your question? Could you repeat your question, please? Please um, be more specific in the question because I find it difficult to respond to, je... as it's rather broad. Une qui est un peu large et je That's my fault, Mr. Tsai, not yours. Let me simplify the question. 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 Let me Mr. Nguyen Chia and uh, Mr. Kyu Sampan talked during 
the three they parler or the four they work tout au long des trois ou quatre jours de durée de formation and these uh, people uh, were the senior uh, leaders so they could have been in the sessions longer than the other low level uh, cadre so they were there to tell us to educate donc to educate us on que how de to work inférieur ils étaient là pour very nous well. euh, enseigner à bien travailler the president thank you mr witness and thank you mr co prosecutor it is now appropriate moment for the morning adjournment the chamber will adjourn um, for une pause de 20 minutes the next session will be resumed by 10 to 11 rather by 20 10 to 11. The court is adjourned. Lord John Silvey.